Hey guys, I want to discuss something. In the LEGO Daily Bugle, there are 20 plus minifigures, but only about 4 to 5 minifigs have night printing. Just let me process something real quick. Okay, I'm done. What the heck? Lego is a super popular kids toy, not only for kids, but for adults as well. But Lego has missed something. Lego minifig leg printing. Like I said earlier, not very many of these minifigures from the Lego Daily Bugle set have Lego minifig leg printing. Uh, as stated, like Mysterio, you've got... Gwen Stacy, Gwen Spider-Man, you've got Venom with no leg printing. The only ones that have leg printing are Green Goblin, you've got Spider-Man with the dual molded legs, and I really don't count the dual molded legs being real leg printing, but at least it works. But a lot of these minifigs don't actually have leg printing, and I'm kind of upset about it. As you can see, Blade doesn't have leg printing, and Firestar don't have leg printing, None of these figures have very much leg printing. They're all just bland legs. Lego could do a whole lot better than this. According to the Lego Marvel Minifig Series CMF, a lot of these minifigs have leg printing and also side leg printing, which is super unnatural. And I really, really like it. I think it's something that Lego should actually involve in real sets and not just minifig CMF series. I think it's just great, and I think they should do it for more than just that. Hey guys, it's your man, Aquamac TV. Make sure to subscribe, like, and comment down below what you thought about this video. Thank you guys for watching. May God bless you. May the brick be with you. Aquamike out.